you positive that he saw you? He looked right at me. Maybe he's got a bad memory. You could forget that, please. Yeah, or maybe he blanked you. I hear he didn't find you very receptive to his story. Well, all I did was reassure him that he hadn't been possessed by a spirit from the other side. Yes, it's that degree of certainty that concerns me. And you would have told him otherwise? I would have told him that communing with the dead is a momentous undertaking. Well, he wanted my opinion as a scientist. Well, from that perspective, it's not. From that perspective, there's no evidence. There's no incontrovertible proof. That's not the same uh, thing. OK, OK. Let's say that he did see Craig and that he hasn't got a bad memory. He must be suffering from some kind of disorder. Yeah, it's possible. It's the only explanation. It's not the only explanation. Just as unscrupulous mediums and autosuggestive delusions are not the only dangers of conducting seances. I thought we built on what we know to discover what we don't, and remembering the difference keeps us out of the fair ground. Right, but we still have to have respect for what we don't know. We haven't yet found intelligent life on other planets, but no self-respecting astronomer is going to be arrogant enough to tell you that it doesn't exist. 